Hello and welcome to a brand new episode of the 360 Daily Show, where we bring you the latest news in fashion and lifestyle. Black Bones kicks off his Mr. Romantic era with new single, Fire On Me. Singorama sported with Tony Elumelu and Rihanna's lover, ASAP Rocky, in Paris. And Kim Kardashian embraces Italian widow core. And on our trending segment, Black Bones kicks off his Mr. Romantic era with new single, Fire On Me. Award-winning rapper Black Bones has kicked off his lover boy era with a new single. Following the success of his acclaimed third studio album, A Mecca Must Shine, Black Bones makes his return with the new captivating single released on July 19, 2024. Titled Fire On Me, the soulful anthem captures all the tapestries of a sizzling Soma romance. On the single, Black Bones narrates a tale of passion and emotion punctuated by his irresistible melody and infectious rhythm. What sets Fire On Me apart is its embrace of love, a stark departure from Black Bones' earlier sonic personas, which heralded a mission of anti-romance in albums like Young Preacher and Sex Over Love. Through touching lyrics and heartfelt vocals, the artist bears his soul, inviting audiences on a journey of vulnerability and intimacy. And on our sporty segment, Singerama sported with Tony Elumelu and Rihanna's lover ASAP Rocky in Paris. Rema, a Nigerian Afrobeat sensation, caused a frenzy of excitement at a recent event by orchestrating a high-profile introduction between American rapper ASAP Rocky and African entrepreneur Tony Elumelu. In the scene which took place in Paris, Rihanna's lover ASAP Rocky was surprisingly present. In an electrifying video shared on his social media, Elumelu captured the moment Rema with his signature charisma facilitated the introduction. The clip shows all three celebrities beaming, giving hearty handshakes and laughing together. The billionaire mogul was spotted exchanging warm words with Rema and ASAP Rocky before striking poses for photos, resulting in a photo that is now viral. And onto our editorial segment, soccer star Neymar welcomes baby number three less than nine months as a daughter with Bruna Biancardi. The Brazilian soccer star Neymar privately welcomed his third child, a baby girl named Helena, on July 3rd. He confirmed it on social media through an Instagram post featuring photos of the newborn in the hospital with the caption, Helena, on July 19. A mother expressed her joy over the new addition as well, captioning her own July 19 post per a Portuguese translation, My Favorite Month, July. She also gave a glimpse into a white and gold party celebrating the little girl on July 7, writing via Portuguese translation, which celebrated Helena's arrival with a beautiful reception made with lots of love and care. Helena's birth comes less than nine months after Neymar and then-girlfriend Bruna welcomed daughter Maeve on October 6, 2023. And on our new collection, Skims Unveil's Team USA Limited Edition Collection ahead of 2024 Paris Olympics. Skims unveiled a new limited edition Team USA collection ahead of the 2024 Paris Olympics and Paralympic Games set to kick off this month. Short by Greg Wales, the campaign features decorated Olympians and Paralympians Sunisa Lee, Fred Curley, Gabby Thomas, Jessica Long, Caleb Dressel and Nick Mahor posing with the American flag alongside a vintage-inspired red curtain backdrop. The Skims co-founder and chief creative officer, Kim Kardashian, said in a statement that the athletes in our campaign looked incredible in the collection and she could not wait to cheer them on this summer in Skims. This lineup includes a mashup of underwear, sleepwear, swimwear and loungewear. And on Spicy or Not, Kim Kardashian embraces Italian widow core. Kim Kardashian and Khloe Kardashian are continuing their world tour, trading the Ambani wedding in India for the Andre Bocelli concert in Italy. The sisters travel to Tuscany for Bocelli's 30th anniversary concert at Teatro del Silenzio. Bocelli was at the center of a spat between Kim and Courtney on the Kardashians after the singer performed at both of their weddings. While she looked the part of an Italian widow, the concert appears to be Kim Kardashian's victory lap in their family tiff over the singer. And don't forget to catch us up at Spice TV underscore Africa. Until the next episode, do have a lovely time. Bye!